Hello everyone. Uh, I just wanted to shoot this quick video to show y'all something I found when I was replacing my hard drive in my Dell Inspiron 11, model number 3168. Uh, all the research I found on this showed that it came in two configurations. One, uh, the memory was permanently soldered into the board and the hard drive was replaceable and the other was the opposite. At least that's what I found. Uh, it's um, Anyway, I'm just going to show you guys. Uh, there are several videos that shows you how to get into um, get into it, so I'm not going to bore you with this. Um, I've already gotten the screws out, and I actually already popped this out ready to go. But you open it up, you see I've already replaced the hard drive here uh, with a Adata SU800. There's mixed reviews on it. Uh, quite honestly, Amazon had a pretty cool deal on it, and uh, long story short, for sixty bucks, I replaced a normal SATA hard drive with a solid state hard drive for 60 bucks. Um, this computer was originally at Walmart for about 320. I actually got the thing on sale for $200. It was on clearance. Uh, and anyway, so it didn't bother me to spend a little extra money to uh, make this a, a much better device. I just needed it for word processing for school. So uh, I've got much better computers to do more powerful things, uh, but this again, this is just doing word processing uh, for my uh, college class that I'm in. Uh, anyway, this is the little curious thing right here. Uh, this is if you, the, for those of you who don't know, this is the where the RAM goes in. Uh, it's just it's got one SIM uh, port in here. Anyway, I, I've messed around with computers enough to know that this was not permanently soldered in. Uh, this is how you normally get it out. And if you'll see here, this is the new SIM that I've replaced. This SIM that took this out, just got done dropping this in. I got this on uh, from a new egg for about 40 bucks. It's an eight gig SIM, which doubles the amount of memory that comes with. Again, all the information I saw said, said that there was a, you could put a max of four gigs, even going to uh, crucial which is my, typically it's my uh, side of choice uh, to go upgrade either memory or, or hard drive space. Just to let, you know, it's a good way to see, uh, even if I don't buy from them, is this going to be uh, doable? Uh, that's uh, crucial listed it as a max of eight gigs. I'm sorry, four gigs only. So again, I just snapped this on for demonstration purposes only. Um, Hopefully it'll cooperate. Um, so when I did this last time, it took a little while and I actually had to do a hard reset. And because I have pulled the sim out, I'm probably fixing to, to do this again. Uh, if you'll bear with me, hopefully I can get this to come up. The BIOS took a just a quick second to come up last time. We'll be patient. I know it will work. There we go. Again, you notice that the, again, I'm just gonna wait on that. It's popping up, so I'm not gonna worry about the power cord for this time. Uh, when I did this initially, the BIOS came up and mentioned that it noticed the memory has changed, uh, that I may need to reseat that memory. super secure hard drive there. So I'll quickly bring this up so you can see what it shows now. And uh, I have done some quick tests and can tell you that what it's going to show you is pretty accurate. Oh, apparently I clicked on the wrong thing. Of course, I clicked on the phone somehow or another. Go to the system. About. You see there. I don't know if you can see it well. This is the Dell Inspiron 11 3168. And if you notice there, it's showing 8 gigs of RAM. Anyway, just want to show you guys you can upgrade this hard drive and RAM. Thanks, so y'all have a great day.